Hello everybody and welcome back for today's weather forecast. On this video, we are going to look at the latest information on Tropical Storm Darby, and what that means for Hawaii. Let's begin by looking at the latest projected path for this storm. As of 11 p.m. Hawaii Standard Time on July 14, 2022, Tropical Storm Darby was barely holding on to hurricane status, with sustained winds of 75 miles per hour and a minimum central pressure of 990 millibars. It is expected to continue weakening as it moves westward throughout the rest of the day on Friday into Saturday, before making its closest approach to Hawaii by Saturday morning. It will then likely completely fizzle out by Saturday evening. Here is a tropical storm force wind probability map. As tropical storm Darby passes south of the Hawaiian Islands, we can see that the 5% of tropical storm force winds just barely touches far southern areas of Hawaii's Big Island. According to this map, tropical storm force winds will not be a concern across Hawaii with the passage of this storm. According to the GFS model, rainfall will also probably not be much of a concern, with no more than an inch of rainfall accumulation from tropical storm Darby. The only thing that I do believe may be a risk is significant wave heights as this storm comes through. Boaters should be aware that waves may be multiple feet tall as the storm passes. Thanks for watching this forecast update. Be sure to subscribe and I'll see you on the next video.